Hey, what's up, guys? This is Day back with another WWE Shop belt review. So today we have the Undisputed Championship replica uh, from WWE Shop. But before we get into it, just want to thank you guys for all the support, the likes, the comments, um, telling your friend about my channel. I appreciate that. Uh, let me know what I can do better, what you guys want to see. Just let me know in the comments, but I appreciate all the love. But I uh, don't want to keep you guys too long, so let's get right into it. Um, so this right here is just a belt standard uh, replica belt bag that comes from WWE Shop with the actual title. Um, but this right here is the actual print of the Undisputed logo on the actual belt bag, which is pretty cool. So let's get right into the actual belt review. In three, two, one. All right, here she is. So I must admit, I got a little tired of WWE just changing the, act, the actual color up on the actual um, network logo titles. But when they presented this one, which is the Undisputed, like, I'm not going to lie, like, I fell in love all over again. Um, first off, I really love the nugget texture detail behind the actual WWE logo. Like, that really makes this belt pop. And then also what I like what they did on this one. So your standard shop replica never came with a base plate. But this one in particular, I'm really glad that they stepped their game up and added the base plate to these titles because it was missing for so long. Like, look how thick that base plate is. And it makes the belt even heavier and gives it that champion feel. Like, actual, makes it feel like his TV because... If you wanted your belt to like be TV accurate, you would have to actually find someone who can provide a base plate on this belt. And it wasn't the cheapest thing to get like the base plate features on this title. Now, they didn't add the base plate to the side plates, but it's okay. It's actually okay. But this main plate here, like that was solid. Like they're headed in the right direction when it comes to um, upgrading their, their belt quality. But uh, here we go. So this normal standard toolbox here. Uh, same on this side right here. Still got some of the uh, tape on the uh, snap box. Um, also on this leather in particular, like I really like that grainy effect on the leather here that's printed where the W is. And it's all around the belt. Uh, I'm planning on getting this belt restoned by uh, my restone guy, uh, Mr. Richard Simpson. He has a channel on, uh, well, not a channel, but he has a page on Facebook where he offers restoning jobs. So he's like literally one of the best guys, restoning guys. Um, he's my only restoning guy. He does amazing work. Um, he even offers like, you know, payment plans if you're interested in like getting your championship restone. I'd highly recommend Richard Simpson. Um, but here we go. I also got the uh, Roman Reigns new side plates. Um, here it is here. I'm trying to go into a little detail. This is my favorite one though. I really like how they changed up and added the Superman punch stamp on these actual side plates. Like that's my favorite one. And I really like how the design of the act, you know, the travel, travel uh, stamp on the actual box here. It's pretty cool. These right here are just the stock plates that came on the uh, Undisputed Championship. Um, I also got the Cody Rose place as well, which I'll get into in a second here. But yeah, I just really want to give you guys an insight on this uh, network logo, Undisputed Championship, uh, which is currently being held by the American Nightmare Cody Rhodes that our Tribal Chief Roman Reigns had for 1,300 plus days. I miss Roman Reigns already. <laughs> That's why I still have this, his plates on this uh, championship. I love Cody, but I miss Roman already. Um, just to show you guys the back here. Uh, so the back, just like how your normal uh, WWE shop replica is. Uh, you got the screws covered on the Undisputed Championship. Um, that's different as well because on some of the replicas still, some of the screws are not covered up. And then you got, you know, the WWE Authentic stamp here along with like you know the choke hazard warning sign uh, but yeah nothing nothing too different 
Um, you know, you got your screws here to unscrew the plates to put any type of WWE shop plates that you want to put on a championship. But yeah, that's really it for this championship. Um, Y'all let me know, what was your favorite network logo championship? Is it this one? Is it the blue undisputed? Um, not blue undisputed, but the blue uh, universal, the red universal, the normal WWE championship that came in the black. Let me know which one is your favorite. But before we go, just want to show you guys the Cody Rhodes side plates. Look at that. Look at that. Like, I hate to compare, man, but I don't know. I think Cody's side plates has Roman side plates beaten. Like, this thing is amazing. Like, the colors, the skull, like, just look at it. And it honestly looks really great on the big gold. On the new big go, <laughs> like, look at that. I just wish, and you let me know how you feel in the comments. I wish that they had, like, you know, the American Nightmare printed, like, above it or around it. That would have been solid. But these are just the version ones of his side plates. I'm sure as his WWE tenure continues, he's probably going to have, like, you know, multiple versions of side plates that comes out. But this is a great start, like. I really like how it pops on the uh, World Heavyweight Championship. I'm trying to set it up here. Get a good view of it. But yeah, just wanted to show you guys the new Undisputed and the new Cody Rhodes plates. Like I said, again, thank you for subscribing to the channel. Thank you for commenting as always. Um, let me know what you want to see. Let me know what I can do better. I appreciate the love always. So until next time, I'll see you guys later. Thank you.